Jamie, goal for yourself tonight. Defeat for the lads, but another good test. Yeah, um, from the off today, actually, I felt, I felt a bit weird in the warm up. Going into the game, a couple of pints of water, I think it was the heat. I felt really good today for the first time in a long, long time. And I thought, first 20 minutes, we're the best side by far. The water break sucked the life out of us a bit, but I'm not really bothered about the results, really. It's more about minutes for me and the team, really. But I'm sure it's all going to click soon and we'll start punishing teams a bit. Do you feel you learn more from tests like tonight, even though you've lost, rather than playing a team lower down? Yeah, well, obviously, we played against Mortmouth quite a lot, so most of the players are still there from before, so it is nice to see them again, but we know the good quality. So I'd much rather play a team that I know we, we don't know if we're going to win, and it's going to be a tough test, it could be, it could be tight. I'd rather play that than a second division side, for example, and, and, and we thump them. You don't get much out of that because the lads, you, you start playing balls that are too easy and it, you're just going wrong. Got to keep it right. After Saturday, what was said, not just from management of players, but among the players, um, to get back with a positive performance tonight? Saturday is always difficult because, for example, we had three subs. They had eight. I could just bring eight on when they wanted. But that, that doesn't change nothing. They're a top side. They're really good. But we, but you've just got to be positive in pre-season. That's that's the whole point of it. It's more about minutes than than actually than winning. But I think we could do with a couple of wins now, just just before the season to go in to go in on a high. You mentioned the, the hydration break, the water break. They got a penalty just after. What did you make of that? Personally, I asked Ten himself, and he said it wasn't a penalty. But I can see why the ref gave it because I'm high up the pitch, just like the ref is from his angle, and it was I would defend it was wrong side. So from where the ref was stood, it looked a penalty, but the player was honest enough to say it wasn't, and Danny was adamant it wasn't. So you're going to get them, but hopefully a few of them are going to go our way as well. Obviously, you go be going at half time behind, two on down, really quick start in the second half. You've hit the bar. What a strike that was. Um, yeah, I mean, I'm getting a bit older now, so my legs didn't. I wanted usually years ago I'd run that in and go a bit closer, but I looked up and the keeper was quite far to the right. I don't think I tried to get it as far as I did to the left, like, but it was a, it was a good strike. Usually nine times over ten, I'd keep them low and they'd go in. Maybe caught it too sweet. And obviously they went and got a third goal in injury time. Do you feel that was a little bit harsh? I think so. I mean, they had the ball more than us second half, a lot more than us. The majority of the play, I, I took a draw there. I, I thought a draw was a, a reasonable result. But the third goal flatters them a bit, I think, personally. You know, they're, they're a good side, but it wasn't a 3 1 game. On a personal note, you've come back and you look very, very sharp. What are you, what are you, and what are you hoping to um, take out with the rest of the pre season? Um, to be honest, I've sorted myself out a bit. Like I say, I told you before, lockdown. Lockdown hit me really hard. It was tough. Um, everyone put weight on, but I put a bit more than I should have. Um, but now we're playing and it's flown, hopefully not stopping again. I, I should be fine this year and I've got four more weeks just under. Um, I'm expecting to lose a lot, a lot more weight and I'll be flying.